a day in my life as a neurosurgeon teaching other surgeons a new surgical technique. I am in Hawaii this week not only for personal time, but for business as well. As most of you guys know, I'm a private practice neurosurgeon, and I have an extremely busy practice. Not only that, but I also teach surgeons new surgical techniques. I have a full-time spectrum spine practice, and I specialize in minimally invasive spine. Many surgeons with a vast experience in a certain type of procedure will use their experience and share it with other surgeons learning this particular technique. I have a broad experience in a minimally invasive spinal fusion technique that I go across the country and teach spine surgeons how to do this surgery. This gives me the unique ability to travel to beautiful places like this in order to share my experience with other surgeons. It's 7 a.m. Hawaii time right now, which means it's about noon on the East Coast. I bring all the things that I need to teach this course, which is my computer and some caffeine. Today's lab is about two miles from my hotel, so I'm off to get there before 8 a.m. I always want to get there early so I can make sure that all my slides and everything's ready to go so there's no delays in getting the course started. Y'all, how beautiful is this Hawaiian sky? Grab my cone of coffee, get to the lab. I'll have to say this is the first time I've ever taught in Hawaii and make sure all my slides are ready to go. I do my introductory presentation and then make sure everything's ready to get the hands-on lab started. Today I'm teaching two different spine surgeons who have their practice in Hawaii. Real estate in Hawaii is extremely expensive, but this lab definitely was beautiful and served its purpose. Since I am in private practice, I don't get to do a lot of teaching. Teaching is incredibly rewarding, and that's one of the reasons why I joined social media. We all learn through our own experiences, but we also learn through other people's experience and trials and tribulations. Especially as a surgeon, when the stakes are high, it's very important that we pass on our knowledge and skills to other surgeons so we can learn from each other. This all helps us to become better surgeons and have better outcomes for our patients. After four hours teaching in the lab, I'm back to the hotel so I can enjoy the rest of the afternoon with my family. I love the flexibility I have to be able to travel to these places and bring my family so they can also enjoy this experience with me. Now that I'm done teaching, we have a few more days left in Hawaii, and my husband and I are going to surprise the kids and take them to the Disney Resort tomorrow. I'm super excited to share this experience with you guys, so stay tuned.